What is up guys, Gilly Kevin today, back with a brand new episode of Skyrim Remastered Mod Showcases. Hopefully you guys are having a super sick day, and today we have got quite a few mods in one video. I'll explain as we go along as well, but today we are going to be looking at Geralt out of Witcher. Guys, this has got three mods in this one video. Now, I'm going to explain what they are. So, the first one is going to obviously be the armor. This is for males only, unfortunately. Sorry, ladies. Second one is going to be Geralt's helmet mod, which actually allows you to wear Geralt's uh, face on your face. A little bit weird, but obviously it will be shown in this video. And as well, we have got the double swords on the back mod. So, obviously, you get the swords and the double sort of look as well so you get the, the functional mods basically so there's three in one check the description if you're picky or looking for one in particular maybe just the armor or maybe just sort of uh, the dual wield swords very nice mod to have but if you're after that obviously go and check the description so what we're going to do first is we are going to create possibly the dual swords first so I'm going to go over to the section here actually now this let's go over to make the armor so we're going to go into Daedric first we've seen pretty much everything is so that's fine let's go all the way down hopefully you not lag too much out and obviously it's going to be the uh, Viper armor or add-on so, so we've got the add-on here very easy to make got the chest piece there the boots and the gauntlets there so that is the armor set done within itself so that's pretty damn cool then after we've done that we are going to create the helmet which is obviously the Geralt helmet which is going to be located right there two different faces one with beard one without beard uh, is that a beard or is that frost either either for me I'm just going to go for the standard clean shave one there it's pretty creepy just to see a random head there that is freaking terrifying yeah, so let's plop all those on and have a little look before we go into the other ones here. So obviously that is two mod showcases, two out of three. So obviously the face being one, which is obviously armor rating is 46 for a head. Very high armor rating. Don't steal boots, I don't know why I'm wearing those. Add-ons there again for, whoa, our armor rating is absolutely insane. This is some serious armor. 261 value of armor. And let's have a look. Oh, from the back, it just looks sick. Let's have a look from the front here. Now, what we're looking for is texture detailing and obviously clipping as well. Very interesting. Oh my god, it looks absolutely beautiful. There is no clipping there at all. It is seamless, and the detailing on the face is absolutely amazing. And on the armor as well. Just. Wow, it looks freaking beautiful. We've done a mod before like this. I can't remember which one it was. I think it was a couple of days ago, but the detailing on that as well, the Dishonored one. Oh my God, that looked absolutely amazing as well. These mods are breathtaking to say the least. They are absolutely amazing. I am really am enjoying the remastered. Oh, it's just amazing. Look how beautiful that looks. Look man. Look, look at me. Look at me, let's have a look at the boots here. This is the nice thing I'm particular about. Good, the boots are done right as well. Armor's just amazing, just generally. This is absolutely sick. Oh my god, I cannot wait. So obviously now we are going to need to make the second... Oh, well, actually the third piece of gear. And that obviously is the Steel Great Sword, which can be found under the category of, I believe, silver or steel? I'm not too sure here. We're actually going to have to have a little look for it, but... Just the armor and the helmet is amazing. This is all done by the same author, if you are wondering as well. Please do bear that in mind. I'm right, I think it's going to be in here. Come on now. It is wicked, which is still great sword. Not too bad, thank you very much. And as well, I think there is another one, but I'm not too sure. The still great sword, if we category found any sword, we upgraded to a the silver great sword can be found in. Yes, there we go last one which is all the way down in the bottom section here. A little bit strange that they're not paired together if I'm honest. That is a little bit weird but that's fine. We've obviously got a few other mods that we've covered prior to this. Silver Witch Sword. There we go. That's the one I want. Damage though is quite low for a very one handed. The armor rating is super high but the damage is kind of low for that. I'm not going to grind them because we aren't level 100 in smithing so obviously we won't get the full appear of that great sword. Not bad. Oh! 
Ah, okay. So either either that you want to equip gives the same thing of that. Nice. So obviously the great swords still gives you the same look of that. Nice, still gives you the second one back there. That's pretty damn sweet. Let's have a, let's have a look at the little texture. Here. That is so sick. It is unbelievable. And obviously now let's change it to a standard sword. I wonder if we got two of these, would we be allowed to wear two? I know obviously it's not a Witcher, but I just want to see just for like experimentation if we could be allowed to wear the thing on the back with two. Because obviously this would be really nice in uh, conjunction with the other mods as well. Not maybe just this one, but just sort of like just general going throughout Skyrim. It would be pretty nice to have sort of a double mod on the back there. No, it is equipped to both hands. Unfortunately, it is literally going to be a one-hander, but still it's not too bad. Not too bad at all. I'm not sure why he's holding it like that. If it's just going to be the same effects as a two-hander. That's weird. Still, great sword is slightly heavier than the standard sword. Damage is on par with each other. This is also very weird. And the other one gives us more an effect on the undead than the original great sword does as well. Hmm, I suppose just appearance-wise, but then you know, again, I don't know. You'd go for the light one because you'd swing it be able to, like swing it a lot faster. Yeah, three mods in one, guys. If you want to look like a Rolt out of Witcher 3, then obviously you got the full package here. You got the swords, you got the helmet of the head, which is absolutely amazingly done. The textures on it are beautiful. And as well, that really crisp, sublime, and just damn right. This again is gonna be another sort of top favourite to have in your Skyrim world. Guys, if you did enjoy and you did Sort of, if you, even if you just appreciate the armor, not even me showcasing it, but you, obviously if you've got this far, then obviously you did. Smack that like button. Let me know in the comment section below what you think of this mod. I think it's absolutely amazing. Um, running around as this character, or even with the dual sword, is absolutely sick. But guys, until the next one, killer kefir and killer kev out.